What's up, guys? Today, my buddy Jacob, he's a chef at the Casino Steakhouse. He invited us over to try a couple dishes that he's coming up with, so I'm really excited to try that today. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to film in there necessarily. Actually, we didn't get to plan this ahead of time, so I won't be able to interview him and check out the kitchen or anything like that, but I thought I'd show you guys uh, the dishes he's gonna be preparing for us, so we'll see you guys there. We're on our way to the casino. My buddy Jacob works at the steakhouse in the casino and he invited us over. I'll show you his Instagram. He just constantly posts food all day long and it's one of my favorite Instagrams to just go through and the food just looks fantastic. So he's working on a on a sirloin burger. And so every time he's like posting that he's trying out this new burger, I'm like, holy crap, dude, that thing looks so delicious. He was like, dude, you guys should come over and try it out. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. I'm not even sure if I can take my camera in there. I'm gonna try and sneak it in there anyway, but I'm not really sure if I can just film everything. So we'll find out together. I miss it. I wish I was recording. My wife literally got so pissed off at this person in front of us. They were at a four-way stop sign. There was nobody in, in e either of the other spots and they weren't moving. And then they almost backed into us and she like screamed at them. But she thinks she's like, nice. Well, I didn't get out of the car and trying to beat their nope. ass. Nope. Oh my God. It's a Christian Minecraft server. Keep your obscenities to yourself. So we just finished eating. I had the bone-in ribeye, and what did you have? I had a portobello mushroom stack. Portobello mushroom stack. We ordered way too much food. We did, we ordered way too much food, way too much. My buddy gave us free calamari, and we had ordered the crab cakes, and-, and Lobster um, bisque. Lobster bisque. How big was my steak? Like, well, how many ounces was it again? 24. 24 ounce uh, bone-in ribeye steak, tomahawk steak, the first one I've ever had before. It was absolutely delicious and I didn't finish it because it was a lot of meat. She had this like tomato basil- uh, Risotto. Risotto, risotto, that was the word I couldn't think of. But you know what she did finish, right? Dessert. My creme brulee. Creme brulee. That she, that she finished. That she had enough room for, of course. I really wish I could have had my buddy Jacob on the vlog, but I'll definitely be throwing down his information to his Instagram and stuff like that. He's actually an artist too. He draws some really cool stuff. I'll probably be showcasing him a lot more because we've kind of been connecting a lot more in the last couple months. So I'll see you guys then. We're gonna end the video reading a couple comments from the last vlog, so if you haven't seen it, go ahead and pop into that one. First up, we got Autumn Sensei. Uh, she's a friend of mine. She used to be the mod to my stream when I was streaming on Twitch. Glad to see you finally upload. So yeah, this has been a long time coming. Yeah, like I was speaking in my last video, if you haven't seen it, I kind of talk about being discouraged and um, not putting things out just because they're not perfect. So I'm trying to get out of that mindset and trying to just put stuff out there and learning from my mistakes instead of just not doing anything because I messed up. We got Daniel Perry, look at all those chickens. No, for real though, this content is great, man. Love you working through the hard times. Video is top notch. Love you, my guy. Daniel's a very long time IRL friend of mine who just moved uh, out of California and he lives in Montana. 
I think is where he moved to, somewhere in the middle of the country. Burley's Tech, hey, let's go, bro. Uh, Andy Sometta is a guy that really helped inspire me to just kind of start doing this. Doesn't really dumpster dive, but he goes to all the outlets and stuff like that. Goodwills and all that and sees what he can find and then resells them. It's pretty cool. If you haven't checked him out already, you really should. Those videos are pretty fun. And then David Martinez, who's that handsome man with the red hat? Nice video. Handsome is a tad uh, generous of you to say uh, about yourself. So that's it guys, thank you guys for watching. Again, if you haven't seen the last vlog, please check it out and uh, just let me know if you guys, what you guys think of the content. It's gonna be a vlog of whatever I feel like doing that day. So if you guys are cool with that, let me know. If there's something that I did that you did like, let me know about that too. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one.